Hi guys, welcome to today's video. My name is Laura Clark and I am super excited to introduce you to Mary Ann. So Mary Ann is named after none other than Mary Ann in Sense and Sensibility, the flighty sister who can't get the guy who she really likes, who turns out to be a horrible guy. So you're hoping she gets him, gets with the picture. She's kind of flighty, she loves pretty things and you just want her to win at life. Anywho. That's Marianne from Sense and Sensibility, and that is for whom this bag is named. Anywho, I love, love, love vintage and antique past styles and fashions, and I was really intrigued by the reticule. But while I was thinking about the reticule, I was also thinking about, man, I wish I could find a tapestry bag that was really, really great. I can't find any vintage ones. I love, oh, I just really want one. And I'm like, oh, well, I have tapestry fabric. Why don't I design my own? And then I was also thinking, hmm, I wonder what happened to my favorite purse that I got when I turned 10. Anywho, um, it was one of those crocheted square numbers that you may have had if you two were born or had a purse, a fit, bleh, purse fascination. I don't know why that was hard to get out. A purse fascination back in the 90s. Anywho, I got it for my 10th birthday. I loved it. It was great. I don't know where it is now. I hope they still have it, but it was square, had beaded pockets or beaded flap with little flowers on it. Like, you know, the kinds that they made into like the little beaded necklaces all last year, that sort. Anywho, I took those three influences that had been on my mind and the Marianne was born. So the Marianne is great. It is classic reticule shape as in that the drawstrings are the handle and the shape is very square taken from the 90s this fabulous tapestry is also taken from my great love of tapestry bags but never being able to find one that i love 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 and then i beaded it all with the freshwater pearls that i had from my 2020 year of pearls um yeah I actually like them more on the bags than I do the necklaces, though I love the necklaces too, so like, I like them both ways. Like wear a pearl necklace with a pearl encrusted bag and just live a pearl life. So this is it. And what's great is when you look at the fashion plates from the 1700s and the 1800s, you will find that reticules quite often are these fabulously funky shapes that are kind of lanternistic and geometric and very beaded and ornate or they could be quite simple but there was usually an element of decorativeness to them because it was essentially um a place to keep the things you need but make it look super cute so um you could fit your phone in there wallet and keys and I couldn't not have a bag that didn't do those things because let's face it, we don't live in the 1700s or the 1800s. We need to have a place to stick our cell phones because it's not cute to not have one. Or it's not cute to have it in your pocket if you don't want it in your pocket because options are everything. And if you look outside, the lining is really great. Let me see if I can get a good view or I could just turn it inside out yes so this is the lining like how gorgeous is this lining and it's super super sturdy and 100% hand sewn which is how it would have been constructed in the 17 or 1800s in the pre sewing machine days they didn't have them back then so yeah and every single pearl is hand sewn on multiple times so that it's super, super sturdy. It will not fall off at all. It's made to last. And now I'll show you a few different ways you can wear it because obviously it looks good with this sort of antique Liberty-ish floral. And it also looks really good with, it looks great with green sequins or it's utilitarian day and you need to wear it with an army navy coat contrast is everything this is actually a vintage army jacket liner you can get them on ebay and etsy they're amazing 
and you can keep it classic with a white button down shirt. I also think it would look amazing with a trench coat, but alas, I haven't won at this point in time. Anywho, you can wear the Marianne with so many pieces and get so many different looks. You could be as historical as you want, like Jane Austen, or as fantasy history as you want, like Bridgerton, or as um, modern as you want, or um, wear it with a Canadian tuxedo, hello double denim, or you could also go full on workwear and just add a romantic touch, whatever you want. You can make it work with Marianne. Order the Marianne, just DM me on Instagram. This bag costs $2.25 plus shipping. All you have to do is DM me there and I'll send you an invoice. I can't wait to send the Marianne off to some loving new homes. And if you have any questions, please let me know. You can comment down below, send me an email or DM me on Instagram. I look forward to hearing from you and thank you so much for watching. Bye.